had some other things I wanted to say to add on to my previous video about was the, the Sean Porter with the Crawford versus Porter fight fixed? Because here we go with this narrative. It's coming out now. Um, a certain channel, I'm not going to say his name, but it begins with the second letter of the alphabet. I'm going to leave it at that. And then, you know, I pretty much know who that is. It's, it's, it's a couple of channels with the second letter of the alphabet being the first letter in the name. But it's the more outspoken channel. Put it like that. Y'all know exactly who it is. The more out, the more outspoken one. The one that's supposedly is like the, the hothead of the crew. But anyway. This this is this is I hate hearing things. Things like this is what boxing don't need, man. See, we we always talking about the promoters and we always talking about that they're bad for boxing and um these sanctioned bodies is bad for boxing. But a lot of these fanboys are bad for boxing because they push shit like this. They did it with Deontay Wilder. Um they did it with a lot of other things in the past. A few other fights that I could that I can't think of off the top of my head, but they are now trying to do this with uh, Sean Porter and uh, Terrence. They're trying to discredit and do it to Terrence Crawford now. That's what they're, they're trying to do because they know their boy is going to wiggle out of that bud fight, and they know the time is coming. I told y'all already. This is what they're doing. So now they got a fine narrative to spin, and it's it's fucked up because. I mean, why why can't Bud be why can't he be just that good? Just because Adrian Bronin put him down, and just because Errol Spence able to rock him and and put him on one knee, that doesn't mean Bud ain't stronger than them dudes, man. It's like pretty much what they're saying is what he's saying, and, and you know you're gonna have all the rest of the sexuals. The Errol sexuals gonna come right behind him, and they're gonna fortify that narrative. Um. They're saying pretty much Bud ain't stronger than he can't be as strong as Keith Thurman. He can't be as strong as Adrian Broner. He can't be as strong as Errol Spence because those dudes didn't stop Sean Porter. How come all of a sudden Terrence Crawford just suddenly stops him? Bro, I this goes back to what I said is going to happen to Errol Spence. It comes, listen, I'm going to link the video that I made. In this description, check out the video I made called Terrence Crawford versus Sean Porter. Uh, how would it look? That's what I, I, I made that way before the fight happened. Way before. And listen to everything I said in that video. <laughs> it's crazy, right? Um, I, I was listening to it yesterday. I'm like, holy shit. Did I really say that? But... I'm going to link it. Please check out that video, man. Check out the video that I made. And it explains pretty much, hey, everybody got their day, man. Everybody got their day. You going to run into that somebody that got your number, bro. That's what it is. And I believe Terrence Crawford has Errol Spence's number. Same thing that happened to Sean Porter, in my opinion, is likely going to happen to Errol Spence when they fight. And these dudes know he's been on the KO streak, and they're trying to diminish that by saying the fight was staged. I'm like, come on, man. Um, I don't really feel like doing a live on that topic. On this topic, y'all eat thriller. Anybody, Bushido? Any y'all hear this? Um, y'all see this um, video? Yo, bro, one of y'all make a live, man, so we could get up in there and dig in this shit because we at war, bro. We're going to have to stop these motherfuckers one way or another, man. We, we, boy, man, I can't wait to... Air, that fight got to happen, man, so we could put it into this Errol Spence hype job train. Hype train. This is why this fight got to happen because I want to see what they going to say when they, when they, when they boy get crunched. And I want to see what's going to happen, but... Somebody make a live, man, on this topic. Because this is what they're pushing. This is what they're pushing. Go check out that, that live, and you'll see. But anyway, that's all I had to really say, man. Um, like, subscribe, support the channel. 
comment, all that good stuff. Survival Life Boxing, I'll catch y'all later, and I'm off this.